So typically, I would um, I cook a steak when I get to a new state, and I'm in Texas now. But for some reason, maybe the fact that there's cows all around my campsite, I feel like it would be kind of rude. River, leave them alone. Come on, bud. Um, <laughs> so maybe tonight we'll make vegetarian chili um, in honor of our... <laughs> <laughs> cows at the campsite. How did you get out? Did you go right through the screen again? Oh my god. She just goes right through that screen at the bottom. Yeah. Well, the good news is I finally have a campsite because I'm out of the desert and the mountains. I finally have a campsite with a tree that has a limb that's acceptable. To hang my hammock, swing, and chair. Yeah. So. Oh, there's horses right there. A bunch of them. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Look at River. He's being good. Come here, buddy. Cricket does not even know it. I wonder what she would do to a cow or if a cow would just step on her. You cannot bring that in the house. That's disgusting. Is that a cow? But where do you find this stuff? No. No. Go bury it somewhere. I'm gonna fight them all. Seven Nation Army couldn't hold me back. They're gonna rip it off. He's a water dog. He likes the water. Oh, oh shit, go oh, far. He likes the water. Don't want to hear about it. Here's proof even I do dumb stuff. I forgot to uh, pull up the uh, trailer stand before I drove and now it's bent. We'll go back in the shaft. So I'm taking out the bolts to disconnect this and at least make it so I can drive. And then I will go buy a hand crank one and try to get this one fixed because these are expensive as hell. So. We'll see. Stupid thing, Martin. Stupid thing. Um, the other thing is, it might just need to be rebent a little bit, and there could be just a fuse blown on it, and I don't know where the fuse is, because the light won't even turn on. 
So the electrical's off on it too. So it's probably a fuse thing as well. So I was able to get it off and uh, make it so I can drive, but it gets worse from here. I put this away and then I go to my next campsite. I go to take the trailer off and it falls backwards and breaks the other two jacks. Horrible, horrible. Finally, I get the right thing. Everything is back to normal and I get perfect for sunset. Man, bad day. So, I mean, these things gotta be a little over 150 feet tall, but that's not even the cool part. Look at this. It goes right in, the, there's no, you don't see any roots or anything. It goes right into the ground. And look at the how thick the bark is. My huge hand only covers one piece of it. six months um it's been a lot of fun i've learned a lot i've seen a lot my animals have traveled a lot but now i'm back home